Welcome to Sage South Service Understanding and Setting Up Security Group video. Why would you consider setting up a security group? Once you have created a default approval structure, you will notice that any employee that has employees reporting to them will be set up by the website as a manager. Without setting up a security group, the manager will be able to view and edit all the employee's information. Some of this information is of a confidential nature and might not be fit to be viewed by their direct managers. In this example, Glenda is Eric's manager. When we log into Glenda's profile, you will see that in the absence of a security group, Glenda can view and edit all of Eric's information. By setting up a security group, you will be able to select what information Glenda will be able to see on her profile and what information she will be able to view and edit on behalf of the employees reporting to her. How to set up a security group Before you get started, it's important to take note of these facts. Make sure to log into the South Service website as the administrator. Click on Admin and select Security Groups. Click on Add. Enter a name and description for this group. The Security Group creation screen is split into two sections. The Group Security Access section and the Access to Other Employees section. In the Group Security Access section, you will prescribe what information the employees added to the section can view or edit on their personal profile while they're logged in. You will be able to add employees to the section and go through all the access options. Select what the employee needs to be able to view or edit. If you wish for all of the employees to be able to see all their own details, you can just leave their access rights as is. In this example, we are setting up the rights for the finance department instead of creating the security group for the entire company. The way you choose to set up the security groups is entirely up to the administrator and the company's policies. In the access to other employees sections, you will set what information will be seen or edited to the employees that get added to the section by their respective managers. You will see that if you remove the view option, it will automatically unselect the edit option You can also disable the entire section from being viewed by the respective manager.
Once you have made your selections, you will need to scroll up and then press the save button. You will see that our manager can now only view the information that we allowed them to see. Eric's banking details is no longer available in this view. Neither is his ID number or his physical address. You will see that the manager's personal profile still has all of the information available to her as we didn't unselect anything from them when setting up her portion of the security group. Let's recap. Thank you for watching our video. Reach out to us on our various South Out platforms.